Um, I initially heard about Williston uh, from a family friend, Alex Shaw, class of 2007, and um, he said a lot of great things about Williston. And so we decided to check the school out because I think um, at the time my parents felt like I needed a little more hands-on attention um, that they felt a private school education um, would be able to give me. Um, I was kind of a troubled student at the time. And so um, we decided to go check out the school and um, when we went to Williston, uh, really fell in love with the environment, the campus. Um, and decided that we'd give it uh, a shot, give it a year shot, and I uh, ended up staying there for six years. Um, I think one of the fondest memories I had uh, came from senior, senior week, which is a week at the end of um, the academic school year when all the seniors, before they go off for the summertime for their college plans, uh, really get together and kind of do crazy things together. Um, for example, we had a week where we would dress up as ninjas, um, dress up um, backwards and dress up um, in all sorts of different uh, themes and seeing all the seniors come together and uh, do that was fun in itself uh, seeing people in kind of funky costumes but at the same time I think it was really interesting um, to see like a manifestation of our school spirit um, in this week that everybody participated everybody got really into it and everybody had a really good time together um, really made me realize um, that I'd miss the school a lot lot more than um, I initially thought I would um, also, uh, one of the fondest memories I have are also with a lot of my closest teachers, um, my advisors, um, my coaches. Um, they gave me so much guidance, so much like uh, personal attention that I never felt um, um, I really would get in any other scenario. You know, um, after practices, um, if I was looking down, I remember this one particular time I, I wasn't really. Um, into what was happening and afterwards um, Coach K, my coach for six years, pulled me aside and really um, talked to me, asked me what was wrong with my day and we had ended up having like a 20 minute conversation about my, 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 girl, my high school girl troubles. Um, that's something that you know I find really, really unique to Williston. I think a big thing now is the network that a lot of people um, don't have um, the, the network that that I'm a part of that allows me to have friends in all parts of the United States and all parts of um, the world really um, international students I have friends that are all over before I even go to college you know and I'm, I'm not sure a lot of people are able to say that um, that's something uh, very unique to kind of the boarding school life at Williston um, also I felt like uh, I was a little better prepared than a lot of my counterparts uh, at Swarthmore at, in my classes in college um, all the AP classes, kind of the environment of walking from building to building to classes, it really is like a college preparatory school um, that I felt like when I showed up at college there weren't any surprises. You know, there wasn't any uh, drastic change that I felt like I couldn't handle. Um, you know, it's, it's really a good thing, Williston, and um, some people spend 10, 20, 30 years of their lives teaching there. And um, I think that that really is a testimony to show um, the impact that Williston can have on people's lives, whether you're on the teaching end or whether you're on the receiving end. And um, a big part of that I felt was that um, if people can dedicate 30 years of their lives to something that they believe uh, is a good cause, it must be a pretty good cause, you know? And so I think that um, for all those who are kind of on the brink of supporting or not, um, think about people who are willing to spend um, majorities of their lives here um, and I think it's, it's a really special thing um, that I would like to continue to support. Other than the fact that Williston gave me so much so I feel like the least I can do is return some of the favor. I think a big part of it is because I had such a good time at Williston and because I had those experiences um, with my coaches, with my advisors, you know, I would want other people to experience that same thing and um, without support um, it would be much more difficult, if not impossible, for Williston to continue, you know? And if, if I want other people to experience um, the same opportunity, the same experience that I had, the least that I can do is um, try to continue that, try to continue that legacy.